What is up, guys? Welcome back to a brand new Brawl Stars video. Today, we are going to be talking about the new update. We're going to be talking about the UI. We're going to be talking about new Brawler powers, the um, the star abilities, I believe they're called. Uh, there, there's a whole bunch of awesome new stuff to talk about, guys. Obviously, this doesn't look like it's the first time that I've logged in, but it is. I tried to record this video about 15 minutes ago, and I had some serious computer issues. Hopefully, they're resolved now. Let's go ahead and get right into it. So we're going to be going ahead and opening up these 48 Brawl Boxes here. First and foremost, I think it's kind of important. We're grabbing 80 upgrade tokens. I think that's a lot. That's kind of nice. We got an event ticket as well. Those expire every week, by the way, just so you guys know. Got an attack badge for Piper. That's the other thing. That's the one thing I was actually going to look into. So apparently, you're supposed to go ahead and buy all of the upgrades for the first, the first um, area, the pins. You're supposed to buy all the pins for all of your brawlers first and then do all your brawl box openings because you're going to get more value out of it that way um, because then you're able to get the first tier of power-ups and in brawl boxes for this one, the, the crest, the attack crest, like, or all the crests, they're all different for all the brawlers, right? Um, so for Colt, you have the opportunity to possibly get the attack crest and then you can also get the badges, which are 50 tokens to go ahead and buy so you want to go ahead and buy all of the pins first with without going ahead and using all of your coins and everything sorry guys i'm not really I'm a, I'm a little out of it at the moment i was really focused on starting out the video and i felt like i was getting on a roll with my commentary and everything and i look over and my screen is totally crashed it's like oh great i might have to deal with you know issues like that now that's awesome so, uh, yeah, we're just gonna go ahead and buy all of these real fast. Um, if you guys have, uh, just to talk about something while we're buying all of these right now. Um, if you guys have a particular favorite balance change or particular favorite part of the, this update that you'd like to talk about, let me know in the comments below. I'd love to hear it. I have to say, I really, really love the way that they're doing balancing now. Um, by just sort of making, instead of just making everything underpowered, they're making everything overpowered as, like, the most overpowered thing in the game. At least that's, that's sort of the thing that, the, the kind of, uh, inkling that I have as to how they're balancing because they've added in all of these awesome new star powers. So, uh, I'm excited to see where the metagame goes from here. The competitive metagame is going to be very, very interesting. And how competitive leagues are going to function now that we have friendly battles and everything. I think that's going to be a lot of fun. Tournaments, obviously, everyone's excited for tournaments. It's going to be a great time as well. But yeah, guys, make sure you buy your pins. Buy all the pins, get them all, and uh, then you can go ahead and do your do your openings because everyone has tons of openings to do i'm sure or most people anyways have tons of of openings to do after this update there's a lot of a lot of coins being given out so we're gonna go ahead and just grab these last pins so we don't waste them on any any just normal normal things like we, we don't waste any of our uh coins basically on these pins you just want to buy all of them they're so cheap right so uh, we're going to do exactly that. And then after we do our opening, we might actually go through and just max out a couple of our brawlers. I'm not entirely sure, guys. We're going to have to sort of see how we're going to end up spending all of these upgrade tokens. But let's go ahead and just get into this opening, guys, and see how it goes. We got some upgrade tokens, so we got 10. So that 80 upgrade token pack probably was pretty rare. 10 is probably about standard. We got a health badge. Not too bad. One out of six badges there. 20 upgrade tokens. 20 more upgrade tokens. I'm definitely okay with this, you know? I, I feel like this is more satisfying. Getting 10 upgrade tokens feels better than getting one elixir, even though I think they're identical. Um, and being able to also get these power-ups is awesome as well. I'm very happy about that. So we got a health badge for Bull. That's not bad. Got some more upgrade tokens. More upgrade tokens. So many upgrade tokens, man. Not a whole lot. Okay, I was going to say, we haven't been getting a whole lot of tickets. I was expecting a little bit more. We're going to go ahead and grab a brand new brawler. We got Daryl, guys. That is very cool. I'm actually very excited to go ahead and grab Daryl. I think he's going to be a lot of fun. We'll actually try him out in this video. Why not, right? Um, just sort of echo in the new update with some new gameplay and have a good time with it. So, I'm, I'm hyped. 160 upgrade tokens. I believe this is the mythic tier. 
Because 80 is epic, I think 160 is mythic, and then I don't know. Oh, we got two event tickets as well. Wow, that's a really solid pull, guys. 20 upgrade tokens, we'll take it. Another 10. All right, uh, not bad. We're going to grab another Piper Health Badge. Again, very, very nice to be able to get all of those upgrades in your normal Brawl Boxes and your normal openings and stuff. I feel like that's a really, really nice way to add to your feeling of progression in the game, you know? They've got to make it so it feels like you can sort of, over time, gradually get towards endgame, but not make it so people that... I guess people that... Um, spend a bunch of money on the game, don't feel like they've gotten their fair value out of the money they've spent. Three event tickets, my man. We're up to eight. We're going to play the heck out of this new mode when it comes out. We got boss fight coming out in a day and seven hours. You guys better believe I'm going to be recording that as soon as I possibly can. But yeah, progression is a really, really big deal. Oh, shoot. We forgot to get all the pins for Daryl. That was a mistake. That was a wasted, wasted, wasted Brawl Box. 100 coins should not be used to buy pins. Definitely, definitely not. Uh, but yeah, we're just gonna keep opening and opening. We got like 20 more to go, and then we might do some other openings. I'm not entirely sure. I guess it kind of depends on what we grab from the rest of this opening. But I think I might actually get a Mythic Brawl Box, or... or I think it's a Mythic Brawler Box, actually, is what it's called. Um, because I do want to get Terra really really bad i might also get one so i can get uh, get an epic one so i can get pam i'm not sure yet we'll have to see but i want to get all the brawlers i know you guys know that we got our crest for shelly that's very cool um health badge for poco works for me i'll take it but yeah making it so progression feels really gradual over time is a super important thing for game developers in this particular space of mobile development so i do really appreciate these changes it feels like things can be just really gradually increased over time you can sort of focus on brawlers you really really like but also you have the possibility of being able to get some of these very valuable pulls in um any brawl box you know we could get a really really awesome pull that can get get us closer to maxing out a brawler maybe i wasn't too keen on spending all the upgrade tokens on maxing out so we're over six thousand at this point we can max out a few brawlers here we got an attack badge for anita that's not bad i okay I'll take it. We're going to grab Pam right here as well, which I believe she's very, very powerful in this particular patch because she got buffed like crazy. Her um, her star power is unbelievably powerful. Unbelievably powerful. I watch, I know a lot of you guys watch Power Bang Gaming. I watched this video where he talked a little bit about her and then played her in some smash and grab. It, it is unbelievable how powerful she is now. The healing is off the charts, the damage output is a little bit lower than you'd like, but if you have some brawlers on your team like Crow, or maybe just some damage dealers like Shelly, or Bull, or something like that, possibly even Daryl, then you're gonna be able to do a lot with her, and she's gonna play very well as a tanky support brawler, and that's something that's gonna be very, very nice moving forward in the game. So, uh, maybe, maybe it's worth looking into upgrading her. If, you know, you have a whole bunch of um, upgrade tokens to go ahead and spend. You know, we're not going to do that today. I'm going to play Daryl today just because I really want to play Daryl today. I think he's going to be a really fun brawler to play. But we got some nice upgrades here, guys. We are looking pretty good. Definitely want to go ahead and max out Shelly as soon as possible. I think she's going to be a lot of fun to play with her new buffs to her super. And, uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get into a match. So we are going to be playing... Oh, jeez. We don't have a whole lot that we can do here. Um, that's going to go too well for us with Daryl. Uh, why don't we just jump into a bounty match at Star Gulch? You know, why not? I've not played any matches with Daryl at this point. We might as well just jump in head first and see if we don't embarrass ourselves. You know, this is my first match with him. Uh, we're going to be doing another gameplay with Pam very, very soon. Probably going to end up maxing her out as well if she's as good as... Uh, as Power Bang's been talking her up. We're, at, we're gonna actually grab two Daryls at once here. That's pretty interesting. Okay, so right off the bat, we've got another Daryl on the enemy team. So many Daryls going in. Everyone wants to play Daryl right now. All right, I'm not invincible. That's an issue. Uh, we definitely need to play things a little bit better. I'm not, I'm not invincible, unfortunately. So, you know, need, need to make sure we're actually shooting accurate shots and all that good stuff, right, guys? Kind of important, I think. Um, that's going to be a super there. Definitely not the best super in the world. Probably could have been a little bit better there. 
probably could have been a little bit better. Let's actually, let's see if we can ping pong someone to death. I want to do it. I want to do it really bad. I think that'd be a lot of fun to just ping pong someone out. Um, I need to get used to all of the HP values and everything. Doing math, like quick math with lower HP values is much, much easier than doing it with higher HP values, like what we've got to deal with right now. So I'm a little, I'm a little excited. We're, we're gonna, we're gonna see how this goes, but, uh, I gotta get used to the math and everything. I'm not used to it at all, so we'll have to see. Oh my god, could we not? Could we not? Could we please just get something, something going for us? That's gonna be a kill there. I'm gonna get supered. Not the best super in the world. Really, really could have been better. Could have been better. We really needed to take out that bow there. Unfortunately, that's not gonna happen. Bam! Bam! That's gonna be the come from behind kill. Not too bad. All right, if we could just get some momentum going here. 12 and 24. We are half. We have got half the score that our opponents have. That's really bad. That's really bad. Okay. If we could just just save this, please. Just just a little bit, right? Just a little bit. Just just get in there. Just get in there, guys. Just get in there. God, I need to get used to these new HP values. Everything feels just very very different right now. Uh, but yeah, first game, not going too well, admittedly. You know, could be going better, for sure. For sure, for sure. We know Mortis is right there. He's got five. Yeah, we need to get rid of that. That's that's not good. Oh, wow. He actually did go down. Piper just took him out. Good deal. Okay. I'm going to super. That's going to be a bing bong bing. And uh, not good enough. Not good enough, unfortunately. We're going to actually lose this one. By a little bit less, you know, seven stars, that's not terrible. But losing our first match, I mean, I'm not I'm not too happy about that. Let's get into another match, and we'll see if maybe, just maybe, we can take home a win. That would be real, real nice right now. Um, I don't have enough people online in my uh, band, unfortunately, to do a showdown, a friendly showdown at this point. So we're just going to have to do some normal cues. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm excited for the possibility of doing some fun challenge videos now that we've got friendly battles and all that. Let me know in the comments if, if you have any fun ideas for challenge videos to go ahead and do. And, uh, we'll, we'll talk about it, you know? I'll credit you guys if, if I take the idea, make a video out of it, I'll credit you. So, good deal on that. Hopefully, you guys are okay with that. Wow! Ryan going in right there, man. That was nice. Let's see if we can take out Bull real fast. Or, Bull. Colt. Let's see if we can take out Colt real fast oh come on come on no that was that was just a huge miss that sucks wow full speed ahead he just went ham he just went ham that daryl is just on fire right now okay you know and again i'm i'm sure that once i start getting my brawlers maxed out again that things are gonna feel a little bit more manageable maybe if they don't now you know but uh we'll we'll work on it we actually just aced the opposing team 16 stars versus one star. They got the first star, but they're not getting any more. So things are looking pretty nice right now. Definitely. Th this is good. Got two Daryls. I mean, good times. Good times, guys. Good times. Let's just go for that. Bam! The takedown, man. The takedown. That was great. Let's just take... There we go. Took out Pam. Took out... Wow. Oh, this is going to be a nice reversal from them. Uh, but we do actually... Oh, look at that! That was so sick! I love this super so much. I love this super so much. Daryl is so fun. Even if he doesn't end up being competitive, just the fact that you can just roll him straight into the opposing team so fast is just fun. It's so fun. It's just stupid fun. I, I can't even describe it. Like, you guys need to just try him out if you haven't already. Like, get him and try him out. He's so fun. His super is just stupid. It's just stupid. Like, it, it's just stupid, stupid fun. That That's the best way I can describe it. Stupid, stupid fun. All right. So we're taking home a bunch of kills right now. Grabbing a ton of stars. Um, Daryl's feeling a little bit cocky. Feeling lucky. Unfortunately, we're not going to go positive out of that trade. But that's fine. We're going to jump right on Colt. And that didn't go too well for him. That definitely didn't go how he wanted it to. Jump over this way. Just see if we can... Oh, jeez. Hey. Hey. That's not good. That's not good. 35-22. I don't think there's a chance that we actually lose at this point. 
Uh, we're gonna jump on Colt, though. There's nothing he can even do! We're so fast with our supers. We're just like, we're in on the situation. He doesn't even have time to react to it at all. That is so cool. Six trophies. So they didn't change the amount of trophies you're gaining, at least at the lowest level. Uh, we're gonna do one more match. We'll do one more match at this point. Um, just so you guys know, I think we might actually do the Mythic Brawl Box opening in a different episode. Uh, or just another Brawl Box opening period in a different episode. Because I really want to get Spike. I want him so bad. His super, when it's upgraded, seems really, really cool now. Healing 600 HP per second. I mean, that sounds really, really solid. So, um, we're, we're gonna be doing that as well. I'm excited. Uh, but yeah, this is, this is fun. I really like this update. Uh, bringing Daryl, I mean, he's just, you know, he's icing on the cake. Because the cake is like the UI update. It's friendly battles. You know, it, it's getting the new game modes. It's just so cool. I love this whole update. And uh, I just, I think that it's it's great for pretty much everything long term in the game. Even if you guys don't like that it's going to be a little more expensive to fully progress in this game and max out your account. I think in the long run that that's a positive thing. Because otherwise, I'm not sure that they would get the blessings to go global. You know, we have to be honest with ourselves. Games like this game are made with the intention of making money and uh if they weren't able to make enough money off the game to to consider going global then you know it, it would suck it, it would get shut down eventually and we'd have no game to play we wouldn't be able to play brawl stars anymore so the fact of the matter is if they're able to make a little bit more off of it and uh make it feel also a little bit better for us when we're opening up our brawl boxes maybe a little bit more like we're progressing regularly as a player base or as just a normal player, then uh, I think that that's a really positive thing, even though maybe it means that you, you have to spend a little bit more to max out your account. Uh, by the way, I really like the update to Crow's Super. That's probably one of the better updates this particular patch. I really, really appreciate that. Oh, man. Oh, man. Bo is OP again. If his knockback could just be a little bit smaller radius, that would be much appreciated. So much appreciated. We gotta trigger these things so we don't end up killing someone. Or getting someone killed, I guess. Watch out, bro. Where- wait, where are- oh, I was gonna say, where did they go? Where did they go? There's another one. Oh, geez, we're getting hit. Yeah, I didn't react fast enough to that one. That's unfortunate. And then he just places another one! Just out of nowhere! That's not good. Ricochet is really good now as well. His his uh, new ability is really, really solid. Oh, we need to take out that Pam. I'm going in, boys. I'm going in. Oh, that was awesome. Okay, let's let's do that. That was a nice Ricochet shot for uh, 1,400 damage. To the tune of 1,400 damage. Not too bad, you know. Not too bad. Now, can we get Ricochet while he's walking by? He has no idea that I'm here. I don't think anyone knows that I'm here. Um, if we could just get one of them as they're walking by, that would be so nice. Unfortunately, it's not going to happen. We might actually... Wait, 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 wait! Oh, no! That was so close. Under 400 HP. We almost had that one. That was so, so close. Oh, jeez. I, I love this update, though. I love this update. This is going to be fun. I think it's going to be better when we get to play him in better game modes for him. You know, these long-range bounty maps. Maybe not the best place to start out playing uh, Daryl. I don't recommend it, but, you know, I really wanted to get in some gameplay for you guys with him. Because, you know, I haven't really had the opportunity at this point so far to go ahead and talk about him or play him or anything like that. So, I'm excited to continue making videos off of this update. I think this is going to hold me for a little while. <laughs> Because we got some really awesome stuff to talk about, some really awesome stuff to play. And uh, if you guys know of any esports leagues coming up, make sure you let me know in the comments below. Because I definitely want to get the coop involved in some uh, high tier competitive play. Even if I'm not directly doing it, I think that some of the guys in there are really, really good at the game. And they could definitely play it at the highest level, at least in my opinion. Now, you know, we're, we're, not, we're not a top band, but we're, we're getting... We're getting there. We're we're this we're on the slow come up, you know. We're we're working. So uh, we've got some really solid players, and I think it's going to be a lot of fun to play this game competitively when we do get the opportunity to. And that's probably going to be very very soon, knowing a lot of the people that are actually starting up these esports leagues. So hopefully you guys are as excited as I am, and uh, that's going to be it for this one. So until the next one, guys, peace.